thrift teak. I came to get a big dinosaur. I'll show you that I'm getting it for Davy. That's it. Looks like a brass watch chain. Vintage. I thought this was lapis, but one of the stones are peeling, like right here. You can see that. There's really nothing I'm too interested in today. He's, he's a lot of moon glow. I buy things from this guy that I found some good stuff. A lot of earrings overpriced in my opinion. Looking here. How's that? When they're just France, I think, right? Or England. It's France, yeah. How much is it? 22. It's more than what I want to pay for it. You know, I, I give I sell things fairly cheap. Anyway, I start them at a decent price. More moon glow. More money than I want to pay. Prices seem to go up since I bought here. The <laughs> um, thing is, is I'm not going to keep buying if it's too high. That's just the way it is because I offer my things at a lower price. But I like its booth. I do come here. I've got a nice bead purse a couple weeks back. I'll probably offer from him as well. But, all right. I'm going to move on. This is one of my booths that I really like, though. I also like this booth. I come here. They have jewelry laying around different places. There's a faux Chanel. Right there. I look here. I found a couple of things here. But, um, there's me. Me and my belly. See, they have jewelry laying around. Like, I like this thing over here. It's Asian. It's too high priced for me, though. But there's not a lot of jewelry here, but I have found a couple good pairs of earrings in this area that I was able to resell. Yeah. It's a big Coors Light sign. Camera may be all over the place. Like I said, I'm fairly new at this, at doing this. I don't do it often. But, all right. Get on out of here. I think she hangs stuff up here. There doesn't look to be anything too great, but I'll look. Here's another one that's nice. Um, look at her, she's beautiful. I can't really buy myself anything right now, but look. I really like her. Oh, fairy. I'm not, I don't think it's albaster. It's resin or, or whatever they call that. I can't remember what it's called, but I really like her. But I'm not buying myself anything today, so I can't. Like I said, I came here to get Davy's dinosaur and see if there's any jewelry. But it's not set up nicely though. A lot of them are. They have a lot of cute things here. Oh. Elephants, I like those. I mean, they have a lot of nice cute things in all, most of them, but some of them are side up. Look at him, I like him. Oh, he's cute, I have to check his purse. I mean, you know, I've gotta keep the kids in mind. Um, you have kids who wanna decorate things cutely for you children and grandchildren and he has no price or I don't know he's like a candy jar or something uh, I like him I don't know how much he is but he's cute you know I like a little difference I love red birds there's two cardinals right there I mean buying this isn't a waste I consider because it's Christmas decorations and keeps the kids happy you like a an environment that's set up for children in the home you know all right, let me get on out of here. I'm going to show you some lovely hats and scarves and gloves a little ways down here. Look at these guys. A lot of unique earrings. Like red chairs. Oh my God. Flower. I think they're cool. Coffee cup. And coffee cups and different colors. Pans. Fans. I mean, really cool. Cuckoo clock. I kind of like these. I feel like those grapes you used to have on, like the rubbery ones, like Grandma. My grandma definitely had them. Some knives or hatchets. What is this? A sword or something? not a sword? Wrenches. I mean, I've got a couple of dice, hats, whistles, <laughs> a variety of different um, uniqueness. Somebody makes these earrings here, I guess. They're all costume. I'm pretty certain. Cute though. I think they're cute. Here's another one that I look at sometimes. This lady makes her own jewelry, I think. There's like a variety of different like little earrings and stuff that she puts, makes, I think. I don't know. I think these are costume. I thought they were coral, but I think they're costume. Like little cabochons of plastic. And just different things. But I look here because I found a couple of good things in this um, area. 
Yeah, she it's just a variety. She makes homemade things, homemade jewelry, and then just a variety of other vintage or antique things in this store. Not everything is antique, though. Um, I got myself a mason jar to hold my toothbrush in, and Davies, because me and Eve have her own bathroom. She's her own bathroom upstairs, and I've, you know, Davies at the house enough that he brushes his teeth or something. So I got us a nice little mason jar because he brought, broke my crystal vase I was using. But not today. I got it a few days ago. These are cute. All right, I'm gonna look through these earrings over here and see if she's anything new nice. Here it is, hair. I was gonna look at these and look for names in them. Look, it's fantastic, isn't it? Like, I think it is. It needs wiped up a little bit. I wouldn't wear it, but I think it's a really fantastic hat. As well as this one. Look how pretty. And she has some nice little purses. I love this scarf. But I'm not gonna buy it because I'm not spending money on myself. Look. I bought a brooch like this off of my sister. I haven't gotten it yet, but it kind of matches that. It goes on top of your head. That's cool. This one, they have some. I haven't found any jewelry here, but. Just the hats. And they have some older purses as well. More hats. I'm looking for a Austin. I won't find one in here. I mean, you can see find them online. Look how cute. That's kind of a gold beaded purse. Mesh. I remember these in the 80s when I was a kid. I'm pretty certain that's where that's from. There's another bead one. An umbrella with a Lucite handle. That's... <laughs> Oops, let me get that. Okay, let me get out there. This one has some unique things. Look. I think that's cool. I can't look. I like this. I was thinking, like, what could I utilize that for? I, I, I'm not in the market to buy something just to sit around. I have enough of that, but I think it's cool. You know, they have one of the old Bakelite phones. That may be as well. Cuckoo clock doesn't look all that old to me. Or is it hand-painted? No, I don't think. Thinking man? I think I think it's a real crocodile head. Oh, that's creepy. Right there. That's cool. I wonder what that's made of. I like a friend for Izzy. That's an iguana. He's a bearded dragon. That's the difference. Clay head. Here's the one I showed the other day with that beautiful lamp. Look at the vases. I collect those, but I can't buy any right now. But look, they look really nice. I want 50 for that, 90 for this set, 125. They have a nice collection of items. I like this. It's Pringles. <laughs> sure, you don't know that. The set's gone. The mushroom set, I think it's gone. My daughter has one of a set of these, my oldest. The mushrooms. Sure, hers on Mercury or eBay. I don't remember which one, but it looks like the set's gone. It was there the other day. They must have sold it. More hats and scarves and purses. Those are aprons. <laughs> that looks like a. New York, Paris, something. I can't read what that says. Wilson or something. I don't know. I'm not a hat expert there. I do like them. I don't know if I can imagine myself wearing one. But look. <laughs> they had a collection. Or they bought some of these. Um, collection. Because they have a lot. I like the red ones nice. Nineteen for that. It is a magnet in it. Something I have to explore more is how long have you been using magnets and purses? That looks old, but I don't know how long you've been doing that. Cute. 
These look like more handmade earrings. Too. I think I can. Yeah, I think they are. They have like a gold tone, a silver tone, not at all. Martini things. And there he is. Look how big he is. I probably still knew. And I'm like, I, that's the thing that's making a turkey gobble noise. So, Linda, see, see him for real. I think I could get him new in the store for the price, but these ones are older and they go for more. So, that's plain. Uh, Davy doesn't have a bronchosaurus. And he's big. He's probably bigger than Davy stretched out. So, this is gonna, I'm gonna grab this as one of his uh, birthday gifts. We're having his party tomorrow. He's cool. Oh, there's a beetle picture over there in there. 350. The whole family. Yeah, all four of them. Yeah, so that's cool. That's a cute picture. That was beautiful. Just look at this collection of these. You know, those things you open up, I cannot remember what they're called. <laughs> they have a nice collection. Sam, she's in the market. Cool. <laughs> There's more up here. Ballerina wants a cute party. Oh, I like the pants. Much better. 45. Made in Russia. Oh, we all know that, right? I like the dinosaur one. Should Davy have this too? Found it 65 bucks because he'd destroy it. <laughs> they have collections here. Marbles. This is really overpriced. I've been looking at this for a while. They have this priced 155. Now when I look at it. It's probably a replacement clasp, I would guess, but I don't know, it's kind of late. So this could be modern. You know, they do have modern. It's just way overpriced, in my opinion. It's pretty though. So I'm in my messy car, don't mind it. Look, look, I did get him. He's pretty cool. His mouth opens, his head moves. I think he's vintage. I have no problem buying something used for a kid for their birthday because new I would have paid, I don't know, he's like a hundred bucks or something, these ones like this. But he's pretty cool and as long as tail moves, his legs, his head turns every way possible, his mouth opens, Davy's gonna love it. And honestly, he can throw that down the steps and bust it in a heartbeat. So 25 bucks opposed to like a hundred or more, I'd go for the lower price child does not know it came from a thrift store you know what i mean but anyways guys i'm gonna be on at 2 p.m i'm gonna go home and finish setting up my stuff um i'll, I'll see you in a little bit bye